Three sisters from Melbourne have had their long-awaited opportunity to give evidence against Malka Leifer, the school principal who they allege abused them as teenagers. Nicole, Dassey and Ellie fought for more than a decade to extradite Leifer from Israel, where she fled after the allegations emerged. Many Wax is the CEO of Voice Against Child Sexual Abuse, a charity dedicated to combating abuse in the Jewish community. Thank you for joining us. You know the victims personally. How do you think they will cope with this legal process? Well, um, thank you for the opportunity. I think what, what we need to remember is that these three courageous sisters have been battling against all odds uh, just to get to this momentous day. While it's a very difficult day for them, very challenging due to the process, I have no doubt that they're feeling very empowered and that this is their opportunity to finally obtain some semblance of justice. As you say, many, it has been a very long, drawn-out process to get to this point, um, both for the alleged victims and campaigners like yourself. Did you think we would get to this point? I must say I always had a sense of optimism that something was going to happen right after so many wrongs, so many obstacles. Let's not forget that uh, the Israeli Attorney General just recently uh, said that he intends to indict the former Health Minister Rabbi Yaakov Litzman for uh, involving himself in this case, uh, trying to prevent Michael Leifer from ever getting justice. So those are the types of odds uh, and, and obstacles that these courageous sisters were facing. Today was the first day of the committal hearing which took place behind closed doors. What happens next? Well, we're going to go for another week or so for the committal hearing. Uh, it's essentially to test the evidence, whether or not uh, there is sufficient evidence to uh, warrant a trial. Uh, I expect that that won't be a question. The real question will be, are they going to come to a plea deal? But ultimately, this is far from over from our perspective. It's not only about Michael Leifer. This is about the issue of child sexual abuse more broadly in society and in the Jewish community in particular. It's about intimidation. It's about cover-ups. It's about lack of accountability. So we certainly hope that justice will prevail. Um, you said there that there may be a plea deal. Do you know if the sisters would prefer that so it's over quickly now that we've got to this point or would they prefer to have their day in court? I want to make it clear that I'm not speaking on their behalf today because obviously they're not allowed to make any comment. Uh, all I can say is that in my case personally, where I was sexually abused, we certainly all preferred to get to a situation where there is a plea deal, that the matter will be closed, so you don't have to be cross-examined once again in trial to endure again, the, to relive uh, the trauma that you experience, those are very difficult experiences that any victim and survivor endures through a legal process. Okay, Manny Wax in Melbourne. Thanks so much for your time tonight.